So I got another package in the mail. So I'm going to unbox with you all today this James Jean. We did have some sh uh, shipping damage. I hope the print is okay in there. Uh, this is coming from Avant Art. They usually do a really great job with their crating and everything, as well as James. Uh, and when they synergize and work together and collaborate, um, you get the best of both worlds. So I somehow have misplaced my drill. So we're going the manual way right now. So you'll have to forgive me as I go through and unscrew this crate manually. Um, trying to go as quickly as possible. The print that we are opening today is titled Maze. This is one of his characters that dates back uh, quite some time. I want to say that it goes, she goes back over a decade maybe. And if you're familiar with the master painter Degas, he somewhat was inspired, or the maze character was informed by Edgar Degas' dancers his ballerinas. And part of that, I went to the museum the day before and looked at some original Degas paintings of his ballerina dancers. So to give you all a little update over here, we have five more screws to go it looks like. Almost there. With this maze character, especially in print form, I believe James has, James Jean has made a couple of previous maze prints. Uh, I believe one of them was unnumbered and unsigned and included in a box set of uh, offset lithographic uh, poster prints. And then the other one, I believe it was really nice. It was a limited edition, I believe, if my memory serves me correctly, of offset lithographs. But it was much larger. The quality was a little different. And it was numbered and signed, as is this one. So, it looks like this dent did not affect the contents of the crate. So, have there the invoice or packing slip. A nice little handwritten thank you card. Avant is always so gracious. They're wonderful with their collectors and clients. Nice little canvas printed tote bag by Avant. Logoed. This should be the certificate of authenticity. As is. Very nice. You can see how it's also embossed here with Avant's logo. You can probably see it better from the back. And then James Jane's signature, the edition number, and more information about the print. So I'll read you on the medium. It's an archival pigment print with foil stamped embossing and the artist's unique dimensional chop on 100% cotton rag paper. Let me slide this away. I'm going to switch gloves real quick. I'm going to put on these cotton handling gloves that Avant provided. And then we will remove the print. It looks like it's not going to be 
a bare print. It looks like it may be sandwiched between this cardboard and by the looks of it, if that is correct, this white cardboard is probably archival. And then usually you'll also have it in a type of sleeve. All right, so let me figure out how we're gonna go about this. I could either, I could either cut from the edges here and slice it, or I could try to peel. Um, slicing is the easier and faster route, but it's also maybe the more risky. So let's first see if we can just scrape and peel. I'll flip this over where the different sides are. Maybe this wasn't the right timing for the gloves. The peeling seems to be working fine. I'm actually going to remove this one temporarily. better. So this could be one of the more tedious parts of the unboxing. However, if you are able to score a print from James Jean or Avant Art, this is something that you don't really mind. It just builds the suspense and the tension, maybe the excitement and the adrenaline of what you're going to see. And I have never, never been let down. Un unpackaging or an unboxing any kind of James Jean anything or Avant for that matter always always delivers so let me flip this back over I'm going to remove the top there it is just as expected so you can see it's behind a plastic sheet and you can also see how they protect it in here with the paper just so it doesn't slide doesn't damage the corners we have some fuzzies rolling around with the, the static I'm sorry my attention got arrested by the print it's so beautiful um, I'm sorry you're looking at it through the plastic but the maze ring is all embossed gold foil stamped. Let's see if I can get you a closer look. There you go. And then I'll get you some more details here. And then look at this boy. looks very close to Slingshot and Descendant. And then if we were to peek underneath this corner, we would get to see the custom chop mark that's embossed. You can see there. I would really love to um, take the print out more and slide it out of the plastic, but I don't want anything to happen to it, either during the unsleeving or repackaging of it. You know, once I take this out, I want to have the frame and everything ready to go so that it only, only comes out once, minimizes risk. but. There we have it. James Jean, Maze, print, limited edition of 100, produced 
by Avant Art. Gorgeous. Simply gorgeous. If you are also lucky enough to pick up one of the May's sculptures, they would pair excellently displayed next to one another. But love it. Thank you all for joining.